block, you better back up. We don't have enough road to get up to 88. Roads? Where we're going, we don't need roads. Hey, Marty! M Marty! Marty, I wanted to show you these new matchbooks for my auto detailing. I had printed up. Like the Borean? <laughs> Surely you recognize the clip from the beginning of today's episode. That was a famous scene from the iconic 1985 movie Back to the Future featuring Michael J. Fox and Christopher Lloyd. Directed by Robert Zemeckis, co-written by Bob Gale, and produced by the very talented Steven Spielberg, this movie was released on July 3rd of 1985. Consequently, this movie was the most successful film of the year, grossing more than $383 million worldwide and receiving critical acclaim. This science fiction film follows the misadventures of Marty McFly, played by Michael J. Fox, when he is transported from 1985 back to 1955. He meets his parents in high school and has to go through all of the drama of making sure his parents develop a romantic interest so that history is not forever changed. Christopher Lloyd's character Dr. Brown, aka Doc, comes into play when he has to assist Marty in going back to the present day 1985 hence the name Back to the Future. This film impacted many people's lives, including President Ronald Reagan, who would reference the movie in his 1986 State of the Union address. In 2007, the Library of Congress selected the movie for preservation in the National Film Registry, and in 2008, the American Film Institute named it the 10th best sci-fi film in the science fiction genre. Not too shabby, right? But let's talk time travel for a minute. If you could travel back in time, where would you go and what would you do? Let us know in the comments section down below. Hello. Until next time, I'm Cliff Langston, and I hope you enjoyed this episode of That Was History. Did you miss yesterday's episode? Use the annotation to check it out. You can also visit us on Facebook and Twitter using the links below, and feel free to subscribe if you haven't already done so. Come back tomorrow for more great history shorts, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>